Watch the Al Albert Showcase, 11 a.m. today. Uh-oh. I know it's Halloween. I don't know where the old ark is going. That looks like an old deserted farmhouse down at Grover's Mills in New Jersey. If it is, I wonder if strange things are always happening at Grover's Mills, New Jersey on Halloween. Uh-oh. I wonder what, what's that in the sky? It looks like there are things landing up, up behind the hills in front of the old deserted haunted house. Can you see, can you see anything or is it, is it just me? I wonder, I wonder if Maurice and Wally can see anything. Did you see anything out there, Wally? Nope, didn't see a thing. Well, I thought I saw something way down there in the trees along the shoreline. What's that? Who oh, Captain Noah, Captain Noah. I don't know, I think, I think we're imagining things. I don't, I don't think anything has landed. There were funny lights, but I can't, I can't see anything back there in the woods, so I guess we're all right, because if there was anything that had landed, I would have seen it before now, but I, I think we're perfectly safe. I don't think, I'll take a look back here. No, I, I, there's nothing to worry about. Why am I worried? Why am I getting upset and frightened? Why do I think that maybe there's something going on I ought to worry about? But I'm not worried. It's only Halloween. I've landed something. But look, there's nothing around. Look, it's perfectly clear. Nothing to worry about. I'm not worried. I don't have to worry about a thing. See? Look, <laughs> I'm not worried because there is nothing back there in the bushes. There's nothing in the trees. You can be sure you'll be safe with me on the ark. I don't think I've seen it. I bet Maurice and Wally haven't seen anything. Listen, Wally, there is something out there. No, no, no. Yeah, I swear it. I swear I saw something out there. No, it's only your imagination, Maurice. Well, I did. I did. Did you see that? I told you something landed, Captain Noah! Don't worry. Nothing to worry about. I look back there in the bushes, I've checked the bushes out where those strange lights landed, nothing to worry. Look, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go back there and check it. You keep your eye here on board the ark and make sure that there's nothing happening. I'm just gonna go back here in the bushes. I'll check it out, don't you? Nothing, <laughs> nothing will happen to Captain Noah. We'll be fine. Just Watch the ark. said there wasn't anything anything here at all i've checked it out back there in the bushes and you don't have a thing to worry about we're safe here on the ark okay you can be sure we're safe on the ark i'm going to go right back here in the bushes <laughs> come on come on come on you'll be safe with captain oh my goodness hey wait a minute oh hey yo hey hey what's going on back here where are you from help me join me on board a magical ark wait a minute wait where are you people from it's captain noah and his magical ark all aboard
Well, that was kind of scary. It was scary, Captain. Noah. Scary and hairy. No, I should think so. Where did those people come from? I don't know, all the terrible monsters back there in the bushes. Did they get you? Well, most things in life that we think are monsters aren't really monsters at all. Well, tell me about it. Well, I'll tell you about it because we have the monsters in the bushes are here. You're kidding. And here they are, and they are four drama students. Couldn't you tell how dramatic they were? They're four drama students from down there in Trenton State. Right. Is that right? Yep. Hey, it's nice to have you. Is this the first you've ever been monsterized? Yes, actually. <laughs> and you are who? I'm Jeff Knapp. Now I want you to remember these names because they might be up in light someday. And this is? George Alexander. George, you did a nice job handling the back on your bed with those sheets, George. <laughs> and this is? Mindy Goldstein. Now, Mindy, do you know what, what Grover's Mills is all about? What happened there? Fifty years ago, Orson Welles did a radio presentation in which Martian supposedly landed in Grover's Mills. And right. They're doing a commemoration now. And starting today, starting at 12 noon, mm -hmm. there's ceremonies. Right, and tonight there'll be fireworks. I understand a Martian's going to land in those fireworks tonight, mm -hmm. from what I understand. Now, it's free for anybody in costume. Right. So you'll get in free. Hope so. Do you know where Grover's Mills is, by any chance? No, can't say I do. All right, well, you'll <laughs> find Grover's Mills on your map, just like the writer did. And this is? Mark Murphy. Mark, where'd you get the costume, Mark? Uh, is this I out of know. props down there? The Salvation Tim? Army. I oh, don't know. All right, okay. <laughs> hey, listen, Grover's Mills was a great thing because it really happened to people. You were too young for it, but down in Grover's Mills, people actually went out with shotguns, shot at anything that looked like a spaceship. In fact, Somebody shot at a water tower. They really did. Here's Liz Starr to tell us about it. 